People who have a heart attack often have no history of heart disease and it's a big adjustment period. One of the therapies is to start regular exercise and that improves their heart function but also their long-term survival. So Charles Gardner Hospital has had a cardiac rehab program for many decades in different forms and the physiotherapy outpatient department's always provided staff and a gym space for that. So we found our patients that came to our gym were getting great outcomes. We were able to show they were getting fitter. Um, the patients that were unable to attend um, were going home and doing a program without that support from our gym program. And we wanted to know one way or the other, was that as effective? And that's what led to the study. Sometimes the people that went on a home program, um, the barriers that stopped them exercising before their heart attack were still there. So long work hours, um, other commitments, and although they intended to change those things, once that had the assessment given the program, went off for eight weeks by themselves, they didn't have the necessary tools or support to uh, actually implement and, and start actions that were different to, to those that they were used to. So we find um, people in the gym develop better habits and um, healthier habits, which obviously mm. makes a big difference, yeah. It's interesting because I have always hated gyms and I've never gone near them and I've avoided them. And I thought, oh, damn it, I've got to do this. <laughs> and I've got used to the machine, so I feel comfortable with it. What I like about it is it gives me a routine that I have to be here Tuesday morning Thursday morning and I do it as regularly as I can and it's the company of other people doing the same thing as well, it's not going off on your own and doing it. It's the motivation you get from it, you know, it's the motivation to keep coming and, it, and you know that things are happening, you, you know, you're improving by them slowly but surely. Clinical research is, is a great example of where the patient really benefits early on. I was able to implement from our findings straight away. Those sorts of issues need to be made aware to the broader community so that you know when you have a heart attack you're getting evidence-based treatment and that the evidence has been sought by the clinicians in a lot of cases and not just in a lab somewhere in another country. So from Anne-Marie's experience, she's been able to feel the benefits of the gym program and we know that we're able to explain to not just Anne-Marie but our other patients it's hugely beneficial and without the um, Charlie's Foundation for Research a lot of this clinical work might not happen. Obviously if there hadn't been donations the, none of this would have would be provided and it's critical I would say to people who have, who have had a you know, health challenge like that to actually know how to go about getting out of it. <laughs>